I am going to break down law and order so that you can understand. It is law with some and order with others. It is a messed up plan. Law is what we live by. Order is what we keep. But law is always screwing somebody and order is always sleep. Law can take your children while order sits and wait. The only time that order spoke is when the judge whacked on that slate. Law picked up a prostitute. Order took her from her john. Law went back and confiscated her five daughters and four sons. Law let go a rapist. Order set and watched. Now Law is all flabbergasted because his rapes did not stop. Law married Tina and Tish while Order walked down the aisle. Now Law is helping them to adopt somebody's child. Law just ran a light. Order said okay. Order only defended them saying they were on a chase. Law said go to school. Order said do it at home. Order also said at age 17 you can leave that mess alone. Law said they want your taxes. Order makes sure it's done. Law also sent a letter taxing the car that you just won. Law just beat a kid. Order's eyes were closed. Order cock blocked OPS and Law just struck a pose. Law just took your home. Order said live on the street. Now Law was all pissed off because on their door you sleep. Law said separate from God. Order, he agreed. But when they both go to their offices, they pray while on their knees. Law said it's time to vote. Order switched the box. Order just announced the winner. Everything's a plot. Yes, law is what we live by. Order is what we keep. But law is always screwing somebody and order is always sleep. Law can help you out, but it can also hinder you. Order gives demands. It tells you what to do. Law and order everywhere, everyone gets a chance to live with law and order no matter what your plan.